Learn. Now, class, we introduced marriage. Now, let me ask you, what happens when one gets married, right? What happens when a man and a woman are united in marriage, are united, legally united? So, we call it marriage. Now, what happens when now they move in to a house, right? Now, they move in, staying as husband and wife. You know what happens? Good. Family starts from there, right? Immediately, you get to move in as husband and wife. Now, you start a family. Now, that introduces us to our today's topic, family, right? So, we get to look at what family is and also types of families, right? We get to look at define the term family and also the types of families. Now, family, this is a basic unit of, uh, a unit of life, right, in the, in the human society, right? And uh, the basic unit is extended to include the relative bound, right, together, uh, the relatives bound by blood, marriage, friendship, adoption, right? Now, all these are members of a family. Now, get to look at a family, it starts immediately when a husband and wife moves in, when a man and a woman moves in as husband and wife. So, immediately after marriage, now, what next, what follows next is a family. What does a family comprise of, right? Types of families. We have a nuclear family, right? What does a nuclear family comprise of? It is made up of parents, that's mother, father, and children, right? So it comprises of parents and their children, that is father, mother, and children. Can you get to look at that family? That is a nuclear family. You can get to see that. From the left, you have got a, a, a daughter, right? Uh, next to, to how next to how we have a we have a father next to him we have the mother next to how we have got a son that is a nuclear family father mother children and children now what are the advantages of a, our of, of a nuclear family one the man is able to give undivided attention to his wife and children yes family resources undivided you can't just give your resources to your wife no you got your children also. There is sharing of mutual love and peace in a, in a home. In that, in, the, in, the, in that image you just saw, let me take you back class again. Look at that, right? There is that mutual, there is that mutual love. Now, it is economical to, to manage one family. Yes, you've got father, mother, children. Very economical. And there is little competition uh, for attention. Less strife and quarrels also and stress. Let's look at the polygamous family. It is made up of mother so the father, mothers, and children. Look at that. It is made up of father, mothers, or wives, and children. Meaning a man has got several wives. I've used several, meaning I, I, I'm, 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 I'm stressing several of them, right? Now, in the previous society, it was very common, but today it is very uncommon. Look at that. Look at the polygamous family. Can you see that? There is, a, there, 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 there is a husband there, right? We have got around how many women there? How many wives? That is one, two, three, four, five. Five of them. That is a polygamous family plus children. Can you get to look at the, 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 the disadvantages of a polygamous family? Now, it gives man a divided attention to his wives and, uh, and children. Very divided, right? Suppose I've got ten, ten wives, right? Now, today I'll be my wife, in the first wife, made for the whole month. I've not given attention to these other wives. Maybe next month I'll be the second wife. I've not given attention to this one. I'll be in that family, in that house, plus giving attention to those children. So there's, there's the divided attention. There's no sharing of mutual love, right? And also it is not economical to manage one family. Now, what about a single parent family? This comprises of one parent and children. Look at that. For example, that one. Look at that. The first image you've got mother and children the second image you've got father and, and and children right so it comprises of parent and children remember what causes a single parent family it can be due to divorce it can be due to, di to, to due to death right or also someone can have a baby and decide not to get married let's get look at extended family this is made up of father mother children uncles aunts cousins all those right it is made up of all those, the father, mother. So it is made up of the, uh, uh, what, what, what do you call it? 
uh, uh, from a uh, nuclear family, yes, from a nuclear family to extended family, all those, right, from father, mother, children, right, then you go to those extended family, you can get to see an image there, and extended family, you can get father, mother, children, grandfather, grandmother, cousins, all those aunties, uncles, all those that are in one basket. For our task, class, state the advantages of a nuclear family and also the advantages of a polygamous family. For our reference, get to refer to Evolve the War. Uh, get, to, get to refer to Calvi, Christian Religious Education, Book 4, the third edition. And for our reference, uh, for, 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 for more contacts, sorry, for more contacts, get to contact us via contact addresses that are on your screen. Thank you so much for your participation and stay tuned for more classes. Family, 